Tor and I were just laughing because one, we've never had a KFC famous bowl. What you doing? You gonna oh, come so in this lane? You got a problem, tough guy? Yeah, I do got a problem. And two, an epic comedian. I just saw him on. Remember, I was telling you I was watching Seinfeld. Yeah. I just saw the episode that he was in. Maybe we could call them and ask them to return it. <laughs> Oh, sorry, we can't do that. He's Pat got, Oswald. He, Pat yes. Oswald. He has this joke. That's their most popular item. Those fucking bowls that can't keep them on the shelf. America has spoken. Pile my food in a fucking bowl like I'm a dog. I don't give a shit anymore. But he's on everything. Like, he was Spence from King of Queens for a long time. I think I better be going. I have something in my eye. Could you cash Come me on, in? Spence. Cash me in! It's One of his most role. notable television roles. Yeah. Uh, his new stand-up special on Netflix is hilarious. Gotta keep the races pure. Oh, I hope they don't use that out of context in the promo. That... But this video is not about so much him as it is about the fact that KFC is still kicking along with their famous bowl. Try new KFC famous bowls. Freshly prepared with our homestyle mashed potatoes. Layered with sweet corn, all white meat, crispy chicken, and topped with our signature gravy and three cheese blend. I can't believe we've never had one. I know. We both, of us. Not only have we never had one in the series, we've never had one ever in life. And what we're told is it's just every type of food that they sell in a bowl. I always knew that me and you would lose our cherry together. <laughs> what? So come along, we're gonna pop our gravy cherry all over this video together for a famous, 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 famous bowl. Starting route to KFC. When I wake up, I pull out my makeup, I the bus but while running, I think Hello, welcome to when my KFC Taco Bell. How can I help you? I'm looking to get one of the Famous bowls. Is there different types of famous bowls? I've never had one before. No, no it's, it's only one type of famous bowl. Okay. Just one thing. Oh, can I just get uh, two of those then, please? 1042 will be your total. All right, thank you much. The time has come oh, to put a bowl of food in your mouth hole. All right. Two KFC famous bowls have been acquired. Jump cut. Oh my god, it's like gravy. Dude, this looks good. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I said oh my god to the fact that it exists. Look, at so there's just potatoes and chicken and cheese and gravy. And then is the drink and the cookie in here too? Yeah, maybe. Just so what, there's a diet Pepsi in. and then a chocolate chip cookie in here as well? It's this, concerning. Dude, this is, it's concerning that I haven't just started going into it and that I had the self-restraint to wait. Like, this looks amazing. It doesn't look as appetizing as I know it is. Yeah, and you know, that's kind of like, Chicken and potatoes and stuff on a plate kind of look weird in right. any way. But you know it's going to be good. Yeah, like I'm not above any of that. I'm not like, above anything. This camera is above the bowl, but only in proximity of distance. Yeah, that's This camera just doesn't a... think it's better no, than the bowl. No, no, no. Oh, a little sporky action. This yeah, is spork. a spork ish, at the very least. I don't know if it's a full fledged spork. What defines a spork? I suppose this fits that definition. I yeah, it's both a spoon and a fork. Have you seen the one with a knife on the side of one of the blades so it's all three? Mm. This one, though, interesting. Oh, I wish the fork review were here. Knife. To, uh, if you guys have not seen the fork review on Instagram, it's one of our favorite yeah, accounts. Follow them on Instagram. They review <laughs> forks. They're the greatest. <laughs> Look at this, though. It's kind of like it's a really good scooper. It's, the spoon was definitely the afterthought. This was more a fork first, in my humble opinion. Opinion. All right, this is looking like a pretty good utensil though. <laughs> okay, let's stir. You gonna stir? Uh, oh, the potatoes are at the bottom. Yeah, you gotta yeah. get that all hot and bothered. So pieces of boneless fried chicken in here. This is ridiculous. Oh my God. Popcorn chicken, is that what they say this is? And then there's corn in here. <laughs> Put it into a caulking gun and inject it into my femoral artery. Famous bowls from KFC, cheers. Mm, I love KFC's freaking potatoes, potatoes man. Yep. Oh my god. And their gravy is so good. Mm -hmm. One might even call it iconic. <laughs> mm. Mm. I can already tell this is one of those episodes where I do mainly groaning and less talking. You know? Yeah. How many times will both of us say, oh my god, and groan into the Too mouth? Too many. Yeah. I mean, I'm glad that we haven't gotten this until now because this is ridiculous. Like, this is so good. This is really good. There's a, And this is only five bucks. There's a good chance. And you can get a drink and a cookie with this for five bucks. Is it smaller? We wonder. We got it without it. So we're hoping they gave us a big famous bowl. Yeah, I don't know how that really works. Mm -mm. Now we need to, is there beans in there? I don't no, think I don't, so. No, no I don't think so. <laughs> All right, here's a piece of chicken. Oh, it's so salty. See, it's so hot in here that the uh, chicken gets like, like liquefied. It's a like gooier. Mm. Mine's not as crispy as if you got it dry. Right. Mm. We hope you guys had a great Christmas. Imposter! Imposter! I'm the real Santa! Imposter! <laughs> I'm sure you guys heard the news. If you missed that episode or are just finding out, we got us some shirts, baby! 
Ow. Number six with cheese.com. We're sending shirts out tomorrow. If you order a shirt, if you order a shirt right now, we're sending them out tomorrow. Look how sick they are. It's that thing Corey says. Buy one or don't. <laughs> Number six with cheese.com. Order one. They're super freaking sick. We're only doing like a limited supply run right now. We're going to do multiple designs in the future. It's just capital. We don't have the money right now. Yeah, gotta... so we wanted to pump it out there for you guys. Yeah. So we got to wait until we sell these so that we have the money to get all of them. You guys get it? Yeah. Dude, this is really good. Yeah, I mean, it looks, I mean, I really can't think of a, a more appropriate word than disturbing, mm -hmm. but I don't care. Yeah, I've put weirder stuff in my mouth than this. There's also nothing more America than eating gravy bowls in a car as the windows all fog up. Like that is, that is the Midwest. Yeah, we are, we are the Midwest personified. Damn. No wonder they're famous. Do you think that they were just the bowls and they did so well that they changed the name to Famous Bowls? Or Colonel Sanders was such a braggadocious piece of shit yeah. that he was like, before I die and Norm MacDonald plays me in commercials and also lots of other comedians. He's like, I just got a hunch. These are gonna be it. Right. Yeah, it's a really good question. It's the chicken before the egg. Right. You know? What right. came first? And that's oddly appropriate here. Because there's chicken, and I'm assuming they probably used some egg in this. I sure hope so. Are there places in Europe that are like, you know you can get Chinese food? Right. Do they have like an American steakhouse? So it's called like Italianized Chinese, you know, Americanized Chinese? Right. Do they have the same thing where it's like, oh, Italy putting its spin on Chinese food. Italy putting its spin on American food. And we oh, have like, yeah. Yeah, you go to Cowboy Jack's and they'll serve you up a steak and potatoes. They got a whole big thing of popcorn. You know, and a bunch Europe's of people gather and we have popcorn. And they're like, whoa, this is what it's like to be in America? Yep. And it's just way different. And we yeah, I don't remember that as much. Me like, neither. We're just the best at uh, everything. stealing cultures. Mm -hmm. That's our number one gift, I think. Yeah. I like that idea. I'm making that mine now. That's what the U.S. just says to everyone. <laughs> That's mine now. I just I absolutely know. massacred that. Mine is, there's no more chicken. It's just soup. Oh, some people call that potatoes and gravy. Yeah. You call that soup? Mm -hmm. I'm from Redford. Do you have any of that soup that uh, is just mashed potatoes with a lot of gravy? You know what? Throw a couple nibbles of corn in there, too. I like soup like that. It's my that. favorite soup. Yes, we can pile that in a bowl. Uh, I want my fork to afterwards fit in here so I can put the top Yeah, up. I tried that too. Point one off if it doesn't let me. You just gotta force it. Oh, I got mine. Also look, Taco Bell bag. The old Taco Bell KFC combo. Whew. Now the good part. You probably wanted to skip through all the dumb talk and get to us rating it <laughs> out of five. Man, there's just so many ways you can go. Gravy boats. Oh, there you go. I want to be a gravy boat captain when I grow up. <laughs> choo choo. Wouldn't that make it a train? Choo choo. Steamboat. Boat, steam boats, boats go bro. Choo. You can get a little steam horn on anything. That's true. <laughs> I don't know <laughs> what the f that was. <laughs> Makes me think of Rob Riggle on The Office. After I do my presentation. Nope. Dance content! Out of five gravy boats, how many gravy boats do you give the famous bowl from KFC? The only thing I could think to dock them on, oh, just thought of docking. <laughs> Don't open the dictionary there. Man. I would have preferred a little bit more of the popcorn chicken. Me right. too. Uh, mine was gonna be, I wanted a lot more. A <laughs> lot Mine had more. about four pieces. Yeah, it was a little low on the chicken, but other than that, oops, someone just got a ticket. Red light it. camera, yeah. bye! Enjoy your ticket and also going to court. Yep, sucka. Still amazing though. Yeah. Still just so low on chicken and I love the chicken. There's I'm gonna go with a four. Yeah. Which is a super, super, really good super, score. super solid score. Yeah. That's what I'm going with. I'm gonna give it a 3.75. Respectable. I wanted a lot more chicken, mm -hmm. but everything tasted great. I just, you need more like solid mass in there. After he yells this, we're gonna open some packages. Eat it, bitch, it's always good. We got the good! Quick shout out to a- oh, Not athletic! Juggling! Are jugglers athletic? <laughs> I can juggle. Quick shout out to a couple of new Patreons. One, I maybe I can get the name right, Michelle Hoffert, Hofert, Hofert, yeah. Hoffert. I think it's got I don't know what it is. Somebody just doesn't have a normal name, and their name is MB and Empire. But I don't care what I your name is, it. you're supporting us, I yes! I respect it. And then last but not least, Mr. Puppeteer. Obviously also not a real name, but I obviously still respect it. Maybe he's a puppet who has a bank account, Corey. If that was real, then you'd be Pinocchio and your nose would be growing because you're full of shit. It's not the only thing growing. <laughs> My heart grew five sizes! You'd be dead. This one is from Jason and Jana Brandt. Beautiful family. Hi, Sean and Corey. I'm a long time newer. Now, viewer, Sean, it's the word is viewer. Learn to read. <laughs> I'm a long time viewer and occasional commenter. Smiley face, love it. Thank you for the bright spot you bring to my day. I love sharing the wrestling references with my husband. Yeah, I like wrestling. What can I say? Also, I just watched Class of Champions. AJ Styles, right? Great win. Oh, what a close line. Keep up the awesome work. Love it. Merry Christmas, Jenna and family. Related to Harry Styles? Yes. Hey, 
Oh, here we go. This looks like a Christmas present. I like it. Let's looks see. Looks like a, something Let's a clown would. Christy Carlson. So let's see what Christy Carlson sent us. Boom, bam, boom. Shirts. Full of shirts. We love shirts. Rick and Morty. Oh, this is. Sick. Yeah, that is sick. Szechuan, what's it say? Szechuan dipping sauce. That oh my is god! Sick. They created a new sauce for the McNuggets called Szechuan sauce, and it's delicious. Look at that! What else we got here? Pothead. <laughs> oh, from your for my Halloween, Halloween costume. costume. You guys are like at a weird like angle. Like I feel like I gotta be like so funny. That's super good. And then we've got. I'm, I'm just, just here for the pizza. These are all super awesome. Dude. And then we got a shite ton of uh, candy, which is Sean's thing. I'm sure yeah, he's gonna be. Yeah, I'm gonna go. That. That's on that right Take now. That. This is amazing. This is such a girl thing. Girls always love using the cool colored ink. Yeah. I love it. it. Reminds me of high uh, school. I miss girls writing me notes. notes. I mean, my friends used to get notes from girls. It seemed awesome. Yeah, but I'm sure it was. <laughs> Sean and Corey, happy holidays. I've been a fan since the beginning on Sean's social media pessimist channel. Old Throwback. school fan. Oh, Old school fan. That's I used to awesome. vlog. The social media pessimist. Congrats on 10,000 subscribers. Number Six with Cheese is such a great channel. I wish you guys even more success in 2018. Keep up the great work. Much love. Christy Carlson. You are a goddamn hero and I love you for it. How many Twix is that for you today? Like eight? Eight Twix! <laughs> no. Amazing. One last one. Oh, I love Twix. Twix are my favorite candy bar. Please send all the Twix if Twix you have money. Twix are great. Really good. What's I, your other one that I think is a stupid thing to love? Three Musketeers. The worst! It's such a garbage candy. You're a garbage panty, Shut Corey. Up. Yes, cool. Cardio. Yeah, good for you. Oh, your shirt glows in the dark, so shirt feet cars don't hit you. Oh, that's a hot sizzle. Papa Joe's, Poppy Joe's, Tennessee pepper sauce. I grew up with a Papa Joe. Yeah. My Papa Joe didn't have a finger. Why? Why are you doing that at my dick? Anytime it comes with this type of lid, I respect it. Also, that is the coolest branding I've ever seen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love caution. Maybe addictive. <laughs> Oh, and there's recipes for stuff on here. Rossville, Tennessee, award-winning. Gives you like a bunch of different recipes and oh, stuff. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah. Seriously, putting your picture on the front of it, the most boss move ever. Oh, we got a little note. A gift from Sarah. Sarah Laws was like, yo, Papa Joe, hook my brothers oh, over at yeah. Is this James Laws' like sister or wife? Thank you. You will see this stuff in a future mukbang. Brainstorm, might even be able to do a cooking episode with that. Yeah. Oh, he does send us those uh, ingredients. We'll see. Thank you guys for sending more stuff. Send it, bitch. It's always good. Stop running, children.